Hi and welcome back to Laran Gaming and if you are new to the channel, welcome. I, I am Laran and yes, it's a big day. It's actually the day when we are gonna get Ocean 2, the Timeless Tides. It's gonna be super exciting. We are on the countdown and as you can see, it's a little less than four minutes left. And I don't really know still what to expect, but there is gonna be one new main island, as I understand. And I've seen also a lot of screenshots, so that's gonna be super exciting to see. Also all the new items and fishes, so yeah. So let's just see what's uh, gonna happen to the balloon. Because I've also seen a different version of the balloon in a video. So yeah, any time now, but... Uh, yeah, everyone here is eager and everyone here is waiting, as you can see. But then again, you need to be level 40 to actually enjoy the new content, because that's the level requirement when you do the quest. If you do have questions regarding the quest, I will put down a link down in the description describing what to do in that quest. I did a video of that earlier this week, so just go check it out. And a little less than one minute left. Alright, so it's getting close. Five seconds. And there we have it. The, <laughs> the countdown timer went down to zero. Okay, so let's see if we're gonna have a server restart anytime soon. And maybe my guess was right. Now it's restarting. And we have updates. And check the updates right away. So, new Timeless Tides Ocean, new Smuggler's Bay Island, new Ocean Fishing Rod Chest and Skins, new Ocean Throwing Axes, that's gonna be interesting, new Ocean Boats, new Ocean Backpacks, new Ocean Fish, new Cannon Mechanics, this is gonna be entertaining, new Armored Shark in Timeless Tides. Alright, oh, we have a new model of the balloon, fantastic. And it looks like this. We're gonna go into the free camera right away. Oh, I got a little bit of a lag spike there. But it's all good. Uh, it has some kind of propeller and a, an engine. Because, yeah, it needs to travel quite a bit, I believe. Long distance. I don't really know if this balloon is gonna be the same for everyone. If you have even done the quest. Maybe not, because uh, you did the quest to actually upgrade the balloon. But I'm gonna find out later. Yes, and here we have it. The Smuggler's Bay. It's currently the only island that we have here. Over at Timeless Tides. And it's like a new Port Jackson basically. So it starts off with a balloon. This is where you arrive. You go through the main entrance. Over to the left you have the boat shop. You also have all the scoreboards or the leaderboards here at the entrance. And then you go over to the chests, three different ones, just like Port Jackson, but this time with new content and new rods. To the right we have the pet shop. And over here we have caster, where you can sell all your, all your fish. Now you also can actually use the fish as ammunition to cannons, so that's a little bit weird. <laughs> we can go up a little bit so we get a better overview of everything. So it looks like this. Over there we have the entrance. We have the boat shop. We have the pet shop. We have where you can sell all the fish. Over here we have cannons where you can shoot the fish. <laughs> or use it as ammunition I should say. If you don't want to sell the fish. We have the supply shop. Here is also where you can buy the new backpacks. And you also can buy the new axes. Which is what you need to have when uh, facing the new sea creature that you have out here in the ocean. Which is the armored shark. You have the UGC store. We can go over here. We have actually a waterfall. Up here we have an aquarium. You can reach it actually with a cannon. So if we go back a little bit. And uh, just take a look, if we go here over at the entrance, where you have the pet shop or the pet store, you have a cannon. It also says here, aquariums, you can shoot yourself, you just use the cannon and you shoot yourself all the way up to the aquarium. <laughs> which is an, an awesome way of transporting yourself. The Wandering Merchant is also near this cannon. It uh, currently has the same items as uh, the merchant in Port Jackson. And I think uh, that's going to be the case. 
or at least it seems like it right now. So either if you use the cannon to get up to the aquarium or you just go around these houses here and uh, go through the gate over here, eventually you will come up to this place where you have the tavern. It's uh, just behind this house up here. What's so special about this place is that you have brand new shard quests. Uh, it seems like uh, three different difficulty levels. So it's like one easy, one medium and one supposed to be hard. And uh, over there you had the aquarium. So I'm going to zoom out to get a better overview of everything. There is nothing that I've seen so far on the backside of Port. Port Jackson, <laughs> Smuggler's Bay. But this is the general overview. And you can see how everything flows. This is what it all looks like from above. Looks very good, looks very nice. It's a little bit stretched with all the walking, but this cannon that you have over here surely helps to get up to the aquarium and also reach the tavern quicker. So that is a really nice and sweet solution. I think we're gonna see some someone is gonna use the cannon. And as you can see, yeah, works perfect. <laughs> really cool. The aquarium is identical. It's the same aquarium that you have in Port Jackson, so no difference. Hopefully we will maybe see a different aquarium in the future. But uh, yeah, we need to take one step at a time. So this is the general overview of Smuggler's Bay. I really like this place. Uh, what you can't do currently, and I don't think you will be able to do, is to have this place you know, on a private VIP server because it does teleport you to an entirely different server. This also means that it's a little bit tricky to actually follow your friends because you enter Fishing Simulator and you end up in Port Jackson as normal. Then from there you travel to this place. So that's uh, good to know if you want to play with your friends. I think they need to be in the main world so you can see them in the server list basically. All right. So that's the general overview. I will dig deeper into each and every place in separate videos because I just wanted to share what this new island is all about. There are plenty of new things that we need to evaluate. We have new rods, we have new axes, which is actually like a replacement item for spears. So spears is not supposed to be working on the sea creatures here. We're gonna take a look at that later in a separate video. We also have new backpacks. We're gonna take a look at those. And we also have new boats and we need to cover that as well. I think we're also gonna do actually shard quests up here in the tavern just to see how difficult they are. And with that being said, I think we have covered the most, at least for an overview perspective. There is currently no new pets. That's the same. And the UGC store, that's just a regular UGC item, so that's also the same. But looking around at this place, I think it really looks awesome. I hope this will be great, and I look forward to see even more islands in this new world. It just opens up so many possibilities. This is really, really awesome. And this is where it... No, I can actually go here. I think and I hope there will be some kind of special fishing area here in the future. But as for now... Uh, I haven't been able to find anything like that and uh, the fish index well it really tells that there is really no special fishing area here at least not right now but there is a lot of things to discover walk around and search random chests apparently where you can get some coins that's cool uh, this is some kind of cave this is maybe a great place to showcase if something glows or not in future videos when I evaluate different items so in any case that was all i had for you today if you do have any questions and comments about this please put them below like this video if you would like to see more content from fishing simulator please subscribe and yes have a nice day hi everyone